Hello everyone. Um, just a quick one. Um, it's not going to take um, too many time. Um, so obviously, when I went to the question, I discovered that there were some um, little, little adjustment I did not make in the video, and I just want to make it right here. Now, in cell B, in cell B right here, okay, so apparently, they said, a placeholder to fill the width of the cell contain the video clip. We have done the video clip. You can see that it's actually plain. Okay, so the video clip has been done. But here is the problem, okay? Uh, we did not display an automated uh, base error message if the browser does not support this video type. Normally, we do this here in the design when we um, click here and then we go to insert and medias and we add it there and then we adjust it but we just had to write the code so obviously the error message is supposed to be here and what's the error message um display an automated text based a text based error message um if the browser okay the browser does not support i'm just going to copy this and i'm going to paste it here okay um, does not support what does not support this video type and to copy this real quick and um yes space okay so this is one of the errors we made another error uh, although it's not really like error per se is there is no need to add the paragraph because you just literally need to put them in paragraphs okay because the question said um you're not going to be marked down okay it's just a, um, probably misinterpretation it said display this test as three paragraphs okay so literally we we'll just have to put it in paragraphs okay but when we apply the h2 it overrides the paragraph okay so that's another modification you just need to look out for um you can take off the paragraph if you want to leave it it's fine um you're not going to be marked down okay but if you want to take it off there are cases where they tell you to impute the paragraphs okay then you have to put in the paragraphs okay uh, but literally in this case you don't have to do it you can leave it it's it's fine right uh but you can take it off um it's okay um but you just you just display it as paragraph highlight the paragraph i think that was what we would call when you highlight the paragraphs right and you apply the h2 automatically the paragraph is um is off okay so i think i think the only time it stays when you're given a break line um, so we have this here and yeah so it's fine we can save our work like i said nothing affects your work nothing absolutely nothing affects your work it still gives you the same result okay so um we can just copy this we can just copy this um just click this right click select all all Better still, we can just copy this area so we don't um, affect the whole work. Right click, copy. Mm. And we're just going to replace it with, uh, replace it with this. Okay, so it will just be, okay, like literally nothing happened. Okay, and we can just okay and yeah literally if you want to take it again it's fine in the case of our video um in the case of our video we just need to put this here okay so you see we just need to put this Browser does not support this video type. Right click, copy, and we can paste it here. So, yeah, I think that's just only thing that we we just um, needed to add to it. Click on file, click on save, and we can just print it. Okay, and um, is this work? Uh, yep, I think it is. Just to replace it, and yep, I think we are. Let's just check. 
OK. So I think this works. So yeah, just the only thing that we needed to um, add to it. And another thing is we didn't look at our CSS. OK, although we are not doing any the CSS, but the need for us to look at it, just look at it and talk about it. OK, so obviously in the CSS, we have this was the CSS that was used. We did not do anything on the CSS in this question, but the need for you to there's a need for you to look at it because obviously this was the CSS that was um, literally added. No screenshot was taken in the CSS. It was just a template. Okay. So um, here we have the borders. The borders 0 uh, px solid black was no border at all. No border was, although there's border there, but the border is 0. The same thing with our TD is 0. And it was separated. If we add a 1, you see the difference. Uh, it was separated. And of course, the border spacing is 20 percent so um uh, each of the borders um, the spacing of the borders was 20 percent from um, the cells um the uh, minimum width was 600 pixels it was in between margin left and margin right although it become it, it was centralized but because it's a hundred width you will not even know the difference okay background color was used in the body and you can see the background color that was used here. Um, the H1 was centralized, and this is it here. Um, it, um, the H2 font size was given um, P, H2P just to find as much as possible. So, just this was the font family used for the H1, H, H2, and the P. So, like I said, we didn't do anything on, they didn't actually do anything uh, on it. Obviously, data analysis was the major part of the question, but there's a need for us to just Look at it. So thank you so much. I need to talk about it and do have a lovely day. Bye.